All right, so just for fun, let's look at a different base. Let's look at base 5. Okay. If I think about the place value notation that I have, again, I would probably just set up these little box, little blanks just to start. And I could think, well, this is 5 to the 0, so that's 1s. Then I have 5s. How many 25s do I have? How many, so this is 5 cubed, so the next one is 125. And this is 5 to the 4th, which is, oops, 625. Okay, so now think for, an exam for a minute. What numbers can we put in these slots? Okay, hopefully you thought I can put any number from 0 to 4. Because if I put 5 in there, I have to regroup. If I had 5 sets of 5, I would have a 25, which would move me over to this place. Okay? Alright, so these are the digits that we can use, 0 to 4. Now, think about that in our number system. Like, I would never say I have 10... 5, 13, I would never say I have a number like this, right? I wouldn't say I have 13 ones, because I know I have to regroup that to a set of 10. So it's the same kind of thing, okay? So now, let's pretend that we have the number 42, base 5, and we want to know what is that in our number system. So we've got 1s and 5s. So I have four of these and two of these. So I have four fives, so that's 20, plus two equals 22. Okay? All right, so you try it. What if you had the number two, one, four in base five? Okay? So you work through it. Push pause or whatever you need to do. Okay, and then I'll work through it um, so you can check your answer. Okay, all right, so I have two 25, so that's 50, one 5, and four 1s, so that is 59. Okay, not any different, it feels different, but it's not any different than if I would say, let's say this is 214. The number 214, I have two hundreds, one ten, and four ones. Sorry about that, ten. Okay, it's not any different. It's the exact same process. Okay, sweet. So now, what if we had to convert the other way? So what if I had the number 72, and I want to convert that to base 5? So I ask myself, 1s, 5s, 25, well, I'm looking at this, the next one is 125, so I know I can't put 125 into 72, okay? I can put two 25s in there, and that gives me 50. So over here to the side, 72 minus 50 is 22, okay? So how many 5s can I put in there? Well, that would be 4. Subtract that. And I have two of these. So 70 base, 72 is equivalent to 242. I'm sorry, let me try that again. 72, which is our number system, is equivalent to 242 base 5. Okay, that's converting between the two. Now in the next video, I'm going to show you addition so we can think about the regrouping idea.